everybody, my name is Mike. This is Charlie. Charlie is an available dog in our training program. He's brand new. This is the beginning of his second week. Charlie has a lot of his commands down. He just needs some work on them and they'll be very solid. Today I'm testing Charlie's toy drive. I'm gonna find out if he likes toys because they can be really important. Charlie. Good boy. So I'm gonna help him work on his drop it command. I'm gonna use the two toy method and I'll show you how that works. When he drops the first tennis ball, I'm gonna mark and reward that, throw the second tennis ball so you can see how Charlie needs to be a little into the toys for this to work. Good. Good boy. Good boy. So at first I'm not gonna name it. Good. I'm just gonna mark and reward when he drops it. because they have to go to the bathroom, but I don't think that's the case. Charlie, good. Good boy, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good boy. Good boy like this, you can't stand it. So tennis balls are always the thing. Try drop it. No, drop it. Good. Good boy. <laughs> so I'd hate to step on the leash and give him a correction, although the collar's fixed so that he will not get a correction here. It is a training collar, but we got it fixed. I'll take it even if it's accidental timing. Good boy. Good boy. Good. So I think it's safe to say Charlie has some good toy drive. Good. Which definitely is helpful and can train other things that food can't. So, Charlie, Charlie, good. So I'll just simply reward his focus with the tennis ball. Good boy. And now it's a good idea for them to see the ball when you throw it. Oh, we've tricked on the handler's part. And of course, when you get Charlie home, one last thing, in order to take this game and turn it not into a keep away, you can run backwards. Charlie, come. Good. Good boy. Good. Good boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good boy. 
So you can see Charlie's done really good with this. We're gonna put this on YouTube and talk to everyone soon.